Gaffney here. I've given you the six minute home workout, the 12 minute home workout, and the 21 minute home workout. They've all been high intensity. Today's workout is around 10 minutes. It's low impact, and it's taken into consideration in particular the knees. I've got my timer. You're gonna need a hand towel, some sort of block. I'm using my daughter's baby formula a rug or a mat, and that's it, follow me in real time, we're starting in 5 seconds. First movement's a Pilates movement, let's use this block, starting on the side onto you can see, left leg down, left hand onto the step there, and turning. Holding that for 30 seconds, if this is too easy then by all means get rid of the, the block you're leaning on and hold there. Breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth. You're gonna feel this through the groin, through the stomach, chest, shoulders, full body there. Okay, changing over now. Right leg forward, right hand down onto your platform and turning and holding. Breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth. Okay, next movement, press ups. Feet shoulder width apart. Breathing in and breathing out. If you can't do the full range, onto your knees. Breathing in, breathing out. If you are doing the full range and you fatigue, just hold that top phase for a couple of seconds and then continue. Okay, we've got our first breather, 10 seconds. Just check my notes. Right, this is one of the leg exercises. Turn your toes out. It's a body weight squat. Breathe in as you go down. Breathe out as you stand. And you're just focusing on raising your hands as you drop down. Chest high, pinching through the shoulder blades. Okay, this time we're dropping down, plank to push up, I'll do it side on, resting on your forearms, pushing up onto your hands, and down, up, down. Just make sure you're alternating the leading hand when you do this movement. Next movement. Okay, not yet. Figure of eight. Lying down to your stomach, thumbs pointing up. Draw the number eight with your hands. So you're just squeezing through your shoulder blades. This is harder than it looks. You're trying to keep your hands in the air for the whole movement. Okay, it's the next 10 second breather. We've got three more rounds, 30 seconds each exercise. We're going into a wall squat here. Now I would suggest once again, toes turned out. Ideally 90 degrees is the target. If you're gonna struggle with that, start upright. Hands open for posture when you round. Put your hands like that, you round your shoulders. So hands open, drop down. Just focusing on breathing in through the nose out through the mouth. And next movement, 
We're going to go into a towel room. This is another posture exercise. Gripping onto your towel. Arm straight. Pull the towel. Row under your chin. This is another one where you think it's a relatively straightforward exercise. It's actually quite taxing. Next one is a push-up hold with a rotation. So holding, twisting up, look up at the ceiling, drop down for a second, make sure your hips are flat in what we call a neutral position, then change. Drop down, change. So just alternating from side to side. Couple more rounds left. We're gonna start now with the bridge. A moving bridge, so you're driving your pelvis up and down. Up and down. Now a progression to this exercise would be up and then taking the weight through one leg. So I'm taking the load through my left glute. I'm changing. If that's too advanced for now, you can either hold or go with the moving. Okay, next, what I call the groin mover, up onto your hands, hold in this position, drive your foot in, drop the hips down, hold a little stretch with the groin, drive out, in, drive out. This is another full body sort of exercise where I'm feeling my chest working, my arms, my groin, my stomach muscles. Next is a side plank, we're gonna do 15 seconds of side. Holding that position, if that's too taxing, Hand down, hold that position, and just stay there. 15 seconds for this one. It's about 15, and change. We've got another breather coming up, and then the last round, We're going to start with a deadlift movement. So knees are soft from the hips, reach forward, hyperextend. So you're looking up at the ceiling, forward, hyperextend. So as I go down, it activates my hamstrings. As it goes up, it activates my rectus abdominis. You're traditionally one six pack. Breathe in, breathe out. We've got two more exercises. And the circuit's complete. Okay, traditional plank now. Hips up, feet wide, head up, holding for 30 seconds, and then we're going to finish with a lower abdominal exercise. Some knee tucks. Got 15 seconds here, and then the last exercise. down, hands open, and just rocking up. Little movement so that your lower back and bum comes off the mat. Keep your legs nice and bent. Breathe out as you rock up.
is a home workout. Good luck.